Hey guys, I thought it would be interesting to share our brand new refrigerator with you guys, give you our thoughts, and then share how we have everything organized, kind of like a refrigerator review slash organization video. So we just bought the LG Inver Inverter Linear Refrigerator. We've had it for over a week now and we absolutely love it this is the nicest refrigerator we've ever owned we definitely upgraded so it is a side-by-side -side fridge freezer and it's beautiful so instead of having the traditional doors these are the handles that you use to open the refrigerator. So it doesn't have your traditional handles like you would normally see on a traditional side-by-side -side fridge freezer. Now at first when I saw the refrigerator in the appliance store, I wasn't a huge fan, but then when we got it home that first night, I just absolutely fell in love. And it's been super awesome having the ice and water dispenser right here at our fingertips in the door. So it comes with um, cubed ice, crushed ice, and of course water. It has an express freeze function if you wanted to freeze something quickly. It has a Wi-Fi function which you can hook up with your phone. And I think you can use that to set the temperature of the freezer and the fridge and to also give you like diagnostics on how the refrigerator is doing and then it has the water filter system where every every time you change the filter we hooked it up to the water system in the filter and the next time we have to change those things out in the next couple of months you have to press this button to set the filter and then it has a lock function so if you have little kids I have a six-year-old who is fascinated by the ability to just press a dispenser and immediately get water if we felt like he was taking advantage of that function, we could lock it and so that he wouldn't play around with that. So we absolutely love it. The area where the water is dispensed is actually a pretty big area. It's like a decent sized area. So you can put like a, a, a pretty big water bottle here or a pitcher or even like a, a small sized or medium sized pot to fill up with your water. So we, ha we have been absolutely loving, loving, loving that. Obviously, we love the look. It is stainless steel, and you can stick magnets on it. As you can see right there, I have my Boston magnet down there. So the fridge and the freezer, well, the refrigerator came with a three-year warranty, and then it has a 10-year warranty on the compressor, which is the motor system. So that's a pretty good uh, warranty, I feel. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to open up the refrigerator and show you what it looks like on the inside and how we have everything organized. This is the refrigerator, the fridge and the freezer, the side by side, and this is how it looks. It has the two large strips of LED lights on both sides, which really illuminates the fridge and makes it really, really bright on the inside so you can see everything that you need to see. Nothing gets lost. I love how much space we have now. It was so awesome going grocery shopping and having everything fit. I just did a huge grocery shop today for the month of June and it was so nice not having to worry about how things are going to fit, especially in the freezer area. Everything fit nicely. I was able to put things where I needed to put things and I still have room for more items. So I'm going to go side by side and I'm going to go ahead and show you the freezer first. Okay, let's go into the freezer. Like I mentioned, this is where the handles are for the refrigerator. And this is the freezer. So unlike your standard side-by-side, -side, the ice and water dispensing system is not in the actual refrigerator. It's in the door, which has given us so much more space and so much more room in the actual refrigerator. So this is what they call the Space Plus ice system. And then in the door, there's actually two bins, like two compartments. And these, I believe, are adjustable shelves. So you can go ahead and adjust them to whatever height that you need. And I just have a couple of items in here. I have some frozen pineapple and some mozzarella sticks. My husband's Coconut Bliss Organic 
dairy-free ice cream, some beef and bean burritos, and there's even more room for extra items. In the actual freezer, and yes, you hear that? That's the alarm system telling you that the freezer door is open. So let me try and hurry up. This bin came with the refrigerator. It's an extra bin. If you're not going to be using the ice system, you can actually use this as a storage bin. We have it in the fridge, um, the freezer right now on the shelf, and we just have some of the kids' waffles. This is a 40-pack of waffles that I bought today at our Costco and some mini pancakes. And then on the second shelf, I love all the vertical space that we have. I did have to take out these. I bought these um, hash brown patties. It came in a long package, and it was really too long to fit in the fridge vertically or horizontally. So I just took it out, which was, I feel like it's better because that way um, I don't have to use the entire pack when I need to go um, and make a meal. I can just use one bag. So I put them in these bags and then I just have a couple of these items here. I have some cheese ravioli, some fudge bars, some lobster ravioli, and some popcorn shrimp on this shelf, which there's some more room on this shelf, to be honest. I have some uh, french fries and some chicken wontons. This shelf holds some onion rings and the kids' pizza, and then we have two of these freezer drawers for fish and meat. So in the first drawer, I have some frozen salmon. I have one pack of the turkey burgers. I have this pack of the Gorton's crispy fish portions, and then I have some tilapia down there and some salted fish down there. And then in this drawer, I have some more of those turkey burgers. I got the, the big pack today at Price Mart. Some more turkey burgers right there. I have some beef that I bought today at Price Mart. I just divided that into some bags, some chicken thighs. And I also have some boneless, skinless chicken breast down there. And I think that's pretty much what I have in this drawer. And these drawers are pretty deep, so they hold a lot of stuff. Moving on into the fridge section, so I'm going to go ahead and show you the shelves first. And as much stuff I, as I have in this refrigerator, there's so much more room for more. And I'm just playing around with the organization right now. Like I said, we've only had this refrigerator for over a week, and I just did my bulk shopping today. So there's still room for more, and there's still time for me to learn how to organize this to the best and use this as functionally as I can. So at the top shelf, at the back, I cut up two pineapples the other day. So there's some pineapple chunks in here. Um, I bought some beef patties, so I have those in there. My fresh mushroom prego sauce, there goes the alarm again. I've never had room in my old refrigerator to store any of the kids' juice boxes. Now I do, so I put like a box at a time. A box of these Capri Suns holds 10, so I have some of that. And then I only ever had room for one box of almond beverage at a time in my old refrigerator. So now I have three boxes in here. There's room for more, but I don't need to put any more in there. So I have three boxes, so when one is gone, there'll be a refrigerated almond beverage ready for the kids for their cereal in the mornings. On this shelf, it's pretty bare actually. I have my son's water bottle, some grapes that I washed up the other day, some more cut up fruit, some kiwi that I bought today, and then more pineapple. Like I mentioned, I cut up two huge pineapples the other day, and these are just easily accessible for the kids for a quick snack. I have this little mesh basket that I keep a lot of these to-go or travel size ketchup and mayonnaise. Those come in really handy whenever we run out of ketchup and I have to go to the supermarket. I always have these on hand for backup. On this shelf, I just bought this bin today and it has some of the kids yogurts and then this is the pizza crust that I use to make breadsticks for the kids some extra cheese because I just went to Price Mart today and then this bin came with the refrigerator actually no this bin I had in my old refrigerator that I'm using to just house my containers for onion and tomato and this is some extra pizza sauce that goes with that crust 
and again there's more room on the shelf for other items down here my mother-in-law makes kombucha so we have a bottle of kombucha down here um, you could adjust the shelves I haven't had much luck with doing that yet so I don't have the room to put tall items vertically so for now this is fine how they are lying on their side I don't mind that at all I have some parmesan cheese extra bread that we keep in the fridge because we do have one loaf out already my husband's tuna some condensed milk and then some extra containers of like to go sauces that we got from restaurants that I like to keep just in case we want to use that um, so this bin can be used for a variety of different things then down here we have these two bins one says fresh fruits and veggies and the other says fresh fruits and veggies so what I did was I put the uh, fruits in the top bin I just have some apples, some plums, some mini plums, and then some oranges because my son, my middle son, he likes to eat oranges cold. And then in this bin, I love how the bins are like clear and see-through so you can actually see all the items that you have. And there's so much room. Look how big those bins are. There's so much room for so much more. In this bin, I just have the extra pack of my husband's tuna some broccoli and some lettuce okay so onto the door this is what the door looks like again i haven't really played around with the shelves yet but i think the shelves are set i'm not sure i don't think these are adjustable shelves or anything but i love the placement so i'm fine with leaving the shelves the way they are up here there is a section that says dairy corner and this is where i keep a lot of our dairy items so i have butter i have cream cheese i have some gouda cheese that's spreadable i have some of this french onion dip I have some Turrialba cheese, which is a Costa Rican cheese that tastes really good. Some more cream cheese. Those are the cream cheese wedges and some cheese slices. These are vegan cheese slices for my husband and then regular cheese slices for the kids to make sandwiches, to put on burgers, and to make quesadillas. And the reason why I have this pack down here is because I already have cheese up here. So that's what I have in the dairy corner. And again, it's a pretty big compartment, almost a container, but it's a brick big compartment. So it holds a lot and there's still room for more on this. Actually, on these two shelves, it's where I keep our sauces, condiments, and marinades. So I have soy sauce, oyster sauce, this mojo marinade. I have this um, mango ginger habanero um, it's kind of like a marinade but you can use it as salad dressing some Frank's red hot sauce some chilero with garlic some teriyaki sauce my mother-in-law made this it's actually like to help your defenses it's like a ton of garlic and um, olive oil and things like that but you can also use this to cook with or put it on salad dressing my huge container of minced garlic and olive oil from Price Mart, a big container of classic oval pickle slices, some Hunt's um, chipotle barbecue sauce, some classic pesto sauce, and down here we have ketchup, and we have ranch. We have some honey mustard dressing and marinade. We have some jelly, some more jelly, some Kraft Real Mayonnaise, some McCormick Honey Mustard, and some chili sauce. And that's what I keep in the door, and they're easily accessible so much better than in our old refrigerator when we had to, like, take, take things out, move things around just to get to our sauces. Almost done, and then we won't have to hear that alarm anymore. Down here is where I keep the majority of our refreshments. So we have orange juice, some tropical juice, this lemonade with strawberry juice, that's like my favorite, my sparkling ice, and then two of the kids' water bottles. And that is what is in the door.
Okay, so that is my refrigerator. Again, it is the LG Inverter Linear Side-by-Side -side Fridge Freezer. We absolutely love it. We're enjoying having this refrigerator in our lives right now. It's such a huge luxury for us. We've never had anything like this. This is like the nicest refrigerator we've ever owned. And we absolutely love it. And I know the kids are obsessed with it as well. So that ends this video. If you guys enjoyed and you watched, thank you so much. I will talk to you in my next video. So thank you so much for watching. And I am going to sign off now. Bye.